Welcome back to Chamber Exchange, the TV show for our final segment. I want to thank Bank Hometown for helping sponsor and make the show happen. I'm thrilled to have with us in this final segment, Ted Goulet, who's a travel advisor at Cruise Planners. Welcome. Thank you, Tim. Thanks for having us. So, Ted, but before we started the segment, we were talking about how your phone's ringing off the hook. Uh, well, pretty much it has been this year. With um, and Travel's back, folks. Travel is back. Um, it's, it's a good time to be in the travel business, I guess, because we're able to help a lot of people navigate all of the, the regulations of travel. And yeah, and then in that, so just, you know, I, I, I want to just segue, you know, cr cruise you know, travel planner advisor, you know, what, what you do, you help. We help. Plan so our agency is Cruise Planners. We're an American Express travel representative. Um, but don't let the name fool you. I mean, we do so much more than cruises, and, you know, and our specialty is actually on land. So, yeah, we do cruising, but uh, the, the majority of our travels with land. And it's, we help to, to curate the best trips for people and navigate all of the protocols and issues. So in that regard, you, you work with, can work with individuals or groups yeah. in putting together itineraries, locations, and really, you know, sometimes you, know, you go on trips, there's kind of uncertainty where to go, where to book, how to travel, logistics from point A to B. You can make the, the, that's the trip. That's what we do. Yeah. <laughs> you hit it all, Terry. Yeah. Thank you. I mean, we're done. No, but seriously, <laughs> that's, uh, that's exactly what we do. And, and especially in this day and age with, with you know, the, the issues that we've had with travel and can you travel and cancellations um, and rebookings for people. Um, we're there to help, help uh, you know, navigate all of that and be our clients' advocates. So. Yeah, and so, so one of the things, you know, as, as we work closely with Massport and the city and, and others in terms of Worcester Regional Airport, and one of the yes. things that we've learned is, you know, with the advent of the vaccine, uh, the domestic travel market uh, picked up much quicker than they initially had projected when COVID-19 hit. Yeah. Um, you know, international, a little bit more uncertainty, but that apparently is going in the right direction. What are you seeing and, and what are the types of trips? And then we want to get into how you're working with the chamber. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, the, we're seeing, yes, correct. Um, we're glad to see that the, the flights are back uh, back out of Worcester, um, which is, is great for our, our local clientele. Um, the, the domestic travel is it's just crazy now because a lot of folks that that are tra traveling when i say crazy there's it's a little overwhelming um for destinations at this point because a lot of people just feel more comfortable staying local and, and yeah. when i say when i say local i say you know that's the united states right um and people want to know well if if god forbid the world shuts down again yeah you know, i want to stay local and i can get home which is great uh, but it's a little overwhelming for a lot of the, the properties, whether they're hotels, resorts, you know, even the, the Disneys of the world, which I don't think that I, I've, I've worked with as many people traveling to Disney <laughs> other than this year. And I've been doing this for decades now. Wow, wow. Uh, so, you know, good for Disney, good for them. Um, it, travel here, and it's, it's more so, I want to go back to it, it's more so because there's a, a lack of help in, in going to the airlines, right. you know, with a lot of cancellations, um, with flights, with folks. It's, it's hard because not everybody's back to work just yet. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But, it, but it is getting better. Um, international travel is certainly picking up. Uh, we found that uh, it, not just for the Caribbean and again, local to, to our continent, but even in Europe, if, if people are interested in traveling and they don't mind the protocols, for, for the most part, if you're vaccinated, you can pretty much travel anywhere. You just need to have a, a, a test before you, you enter, kind of like getting back into the country. You need to be tested within three days. Yeah. Um, but it's a great time to travel to, to Europe yeah. right now because there's not as many people traveling to Europe. We just had 75, 73 people. Um, do a two and a half week tour of Italy. Wow. And, and it was amazing when folks were out, out in, in St. Peter's um, Square and looking around and it's like, oh my God, there's only 300 people here. Right. The photographs that we can take is wonderful. There's not 5,000 people. So there, there, it, there are opportunities um, Speaking of, of for those traveling. opportunities, we've got a, a couple that you're involved with, <laughs> yes. with, the, with the chamber um, and, and group travel in a stress-free uh, way, as we've talked about. Um, Two trips, right? We've got one planned uh, to Nashville, 
uh, right? Yes, Nashville in, in April of next year. It's a, f a short five-day uh, five trip uh, for people that would like to get their feet wet, um, you know, and, and do a little bit of traveling. If they haven't, it's, it's a great way to, to start. Um, Nashville's a great city. I don't know if you've ever been there. I, 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 I have. My wife had a conference here a few years ago. My, my, my wife and our daughters, we drove down and you talk about a great city that's emerging and growing. Yes. And a lot I, to offer. There's a lot to offer. Great food, great music scene, and just a, a lot of history, especially if you like country music, of course. Um, so the, there's a lot to see there. We just had a presentation um, two days ago with the Chamber. And uh, if anyone missed that, by the way, they can always go onto the Chamber's uh, website, uh, worcesterchamber.org, and, right. and, and you know, go to the tab for programs and look up the, uh, the travel programs, and they can, they can watch the, uh, the National presentation um, that tour is in in, in April yep. and then we have a, another presentation coming up in December for our our reflections of Italy tour um, which yeah, I'm really excited yeah, about. Yeah 70 75 people came back from two and a half weeks in two and a half Italy, weeks in, in Italy. We're talking we're doing a chamber tour in, in October November 2022 to Italy. Yes uh, really excited about that and, and again people can register um, on the on the chambers website uh, so far we're getting a lot of interest People want to travel. Yeah. They're at least interested in traveling, and, and we're excited to, to help them travel. Uh, we've got travel. people, have, we're gonna, you know, we're starting the promotion, so I think December 7th is the date we're going to do the promotional session yeah. on the uh, Italy 22 tour. Yes. And you'll be able to talk a little bit about the most recent trip, what people can expect, potential itinerary. Absolutely, and that, that's exactly what the, uh, what the presentation's all about, is to answer any questions that, that folks may have. Of course, they can always contact us, uh, but the presentation will talk about the tour and talk about travel because people really just, they get excited when they talk. It's like, oh my God, I can travel again. It's wonderful. Um, and as a, a, an av avid travelaholic, I love, you can tell, I just, I get excited, I, I talk about, it. we love travel and we love helping people to be able to, to find that perfect vacation and, and take the stress out of, yeah. the worry out of uh, planning your travel. That's well, what we do. It's something that people look forward to in ordinary times and what we've been through over the last uh, almost two years now is the fact that people can think about traveling planned uh, and, and then actually do it safely in a stress-free way, probably very appealing right now. <laughs> well, that, that's what we hope. Yeah. <laughs> And so people want to want to get in touch to, to learn about not only the, the chamber trips, but talk about what other offerings you might have. Uh, how can they, they reach out to you? Any help that we, that we can um, help provide, they can reach us either at 774-261-8160, or they can find us on the web. It is Ted and Tom. We're at Cruise Planner. So on the web, it's TNT Guys, um, TNTGuysTravel.com. All right. Well, good stuff. And... Uh, what was your favorite takeaway from the, you mentioned the St. Peter's Square, uh, the Italy trip. It, so with, um, with the company that we use with that, we, we were able to gain private access um, to St. Peter's wow. with the, the key keeper. And the key keeper of the gates, and, and he has a little over 300 keys. I don't know how he remembers this. Um, but one of our group was able to unlock the door. She couldn't open it because the door was so heavy. But we're, they opened the door, and our group were, were the only ones there wow. um, walking into St. Peter's. And, and, you know, you're not allowed to take photos, but since we were the only ones there, there were some wonderful photos that we're taking, <laughs> so you do get some advantages. Well, absolutely, the benefit for having uh, guides and planners and people who have those contacts. So absolutely. Ted, thanks for, thanks for being with us. Thanks for having me. And I want to thank you for being with us on this edition of Chamber Exchange, the TV show brought to you by Bank Hometown.